this is the handheld refractometer and inside here is a little pin and if you use something pointy you can actually push the pin out and this plastic piece will come right out um, and uh, my idea is to somehow use some sort of glass capillary to create um, to put the pin through and then actually uh, melt or melt would be great um, I don't know if it would work but um, melt it to a microscope slide and then slide that pin back through there uh, it's a little complicated because the glass microscope slide might have to have a wedge cut out of it like this little wedge right here while I'm at it I might as well show you so what I did here so this is it's actually from a different type because it doesn't have the same cover but I had uh, one that was already broken from, from another type and anyway so um, you have to be careful because this doesn't go both ways this is the side that actually flops down and I've actually got the glass piece um, on the side that flops down now the problem with this is I used um, crazy glue super glue and I'm not sure I, the super glue might just dissolve in the benzene too. Um, anyway, so this is where I am so far on figuring out ways to uh, replace the glass, the cover with glass.